What's happening, everyone? Welcome back to the Zero Excuses podcast. Thanks for tuning in. My name is Kenyon Zitska. I'm really stoked for today's episode. Not only uh, what I'm going to be dropping on you guys today, but today marks the one year anniversary of us being on the air. And man, the time has really flown by. Appreciate all my guests, uh, everyone who has supported me up to this point. Uh, I, I couldn't imagine the uh, success that we've had with the podcast up to this point, and I'm really looking forward to what the next year has in store for us. But uh, enough on that. I don't like patting myself on the back here too much. Just want to get right down to business. Today, what I've got for you guys is the difference between an excuse and a reason. Over the past year, this has been my number one question, I would say, so I thought I would address that here. Uh, Before I get into that, though, just some real quick reminders for you guys. If you haven't already done so, head on over to iTunes and subscribe, rate, and leave us a review. You can just head to kenyanzitska.com slash iTunes, and it'll take you right there. Second of all, if you haven't joined our free closed Facebook group, you can head on over to kenyanzitska.com slash group, and that link will take you right to the group where you can uh, just click the join button and you'll be all set with that. And lastly, as always, this show is brought to you by our affiliate sponsor, Doc Parsley Sleep Remedy. Again, this is something that I use personally every single day and I use it to optimize my sleep. Stick around after the show. I'll give you some more details, but if you're interested in checking that out, head over to kenyanzitska.com slash sleep to take advantage of that. Don't forget to use the discount code zero excuses. All right, enough on that. Uh, Like I said at the beginning of the show, one, one of the biggest questions I've gotten over the past year is what's the reason between an excuse and a reason? And let's, let's quickly look at the dictionary definition of an excuse. It's an attempt, an attempt to lessen the blame attaching to a fault also to seek to defend or justify. And the dictionary definition for a reason is a cause, explanation, or justification for an event. Well, those are pretty good definitions, but here's my take. The biggest differentiator is the responsibility, the ownership of of the situation. A reason, everyone involved takes responsibility for the situation. Where is an excuse, everyone tries to shift the blame, point fingers, and essentially says, it's not my fault, I had nothing to do with it. Um, if you ask me, both of these are actually, actually habits. One will lead you to growth and success, and the other will cause you to stagnate and alienate you from, from everyone else around you. And I don't think I need to tell you guys which one is which, but... Reasons empower you to do something better. And excuses basically relinquish control to someone else or to the event and basically render ourselves powerless to do anything about a certain situation. So I really think that we have to keep those things in mind when we're going about our day-to-day life. And that's not to say that you need to be a pushover or to take the blame for everything. But I think we need to walk a fine line when, uh, when we say, hey, it's not my fault. There's always something that we could have done to alter the situation or make a certain situation better. I know I'm kind of talking in uh, general terms here, but one book that I highly recommend that you guys read is Extreme Ownership by Jocko Willink. Uh, I'll drop a link in the show notes. Actually, better yet, head on over to kenyanzitska.com forward slash shop, and I've got that book linked right in my uh, Amazon shop. You can buy it right there. But anyways, that book single-handedly really changed my mindset on on excuses and reasons. And I think that, uh, you know, I talk about excuses a lot with, you know, the show being called Zero Excuses, but... I think that if we can turn our excuses into reasons, I think we'll be a lot better off. 
and we'll start to realize some of the things that we can do better. These are improvement opportunities for us to really accelerate our growth and reach our goals a whole lot faster. All right, guys, that's all I have for you guys today. Again, I am really excited about this being uh, our one-year anniversary here. I have some very, very deeply discounted slots open in my discipline coaching program uh, for this month to celebrate the one-year anniversary. You can take advantage of that at kenyanziska.com slash discipline, and you'll fill out a short survey and have the opportunity to schedule a one-hour consult with me to see if you're a good fit for the program. All right. Like I said, guys, thanks again for tuning in. Before I sign off here, guys, wanted to take a moment to tell you about our affiliate sponsor, Doc Parsley's Sleep Remedy. This is a product that I use every single day and something that I wanted to share with you guys because it has it has had such a profound effect on my life and my quality of sleep. I had to share it with you guys. Sleep Remedy was developed by Dr. Kirk Parsley. He is a former Navy SEAL and former undersea medical officer at Naval Special Warfare Group 1. But to make a long story short here, he developed Sleep Remedy to help his teammates overcome some of the stress and nutritional induced deficiencies that he was finding with them so that they can get a good night's rest and help them reach their maximum potential and perform at their peak. So he's now offering this remedy to the public and you can head on over to docparsley.com and try it out for yourself. He's offered a 10% discount to the Zero Excuses community. You can enter the discount code Zero Excuses, Z-E-R-O-X-C-U-S-E-S, at checkout to take advantage of that 10% discount. I highly encourage you guys to give it a try. This stuff is the real deal. It's not like any of those over-the-counter sleep aids that leave you hungover or feeling groggy for the first half of the day. This stuff will get you into a deep, deep night's rest and you wake up refreshed and ready to crush your day.